Hey friends, welcome back to the channel, Creatively Sandra. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining. I'm Sandra and on this channel we do all things Disney. So today I have an unboxing or an unbaggaging, un unbaggaging, unbagging, unpacking, something like that. It's from Pink Alamode. They did another round of their $100 mystery bags that are supposed to include at least three jumbo pins, an unreleased pin, and a uh, mystery pin, like your two, something like that, um, or the unreleased, I forget. Anyway, it includes a bunch of stuff. And um, we've been seeing some really good bags come out. The route last round included kind of some sneak peeks. Well, I guess that's the whole point of the unreleased, right? So I did one a while ago. I got a really great bag. Um, they did some $50 bags that were kind of eh. But then we were seeing new sets come out, like they released a whole Alice in Wonderland series and then a Peter Pan series. And we've seen some sneak peeks at Monsters, Inc. Zootopia, uh, Wreck-It Ralph, um, what else? I can't remember. Other ones uh, that are that look like they're coming out. So um, I wanna dive in. I just got this today, I just got home, I've got a peek. I also ordered two other pins, so I'm not sure how this is packaged. Everything's just in one bag. There's no separate cute little bag for the mystery set. So this is what I'm looking at this pile here it looks like mm, no they're totally mixed up oh no they're not okay so my two pins i ordered that are not part of the mystery pack are right here and i figured one they had sent me a coupon that said haven't seen you in a while here's 30 percent off and so i took advantage of that and ordered one more of the stained glass pins let's pull him out real quick um, so this is from the uh, Mulan movie, and it is Lee Chang's. He is the the prince or the male counterpart for the movie. And so we've got, let's first show you on the backer card. So this is, I didn't get many of the princes. I don't think I've only gotten um, Naveen so far. And the other one I want is Rapunzel's prince. Um, oh, it'll come to me in a minute, but, uh, Rapunzel and I don't really want the Snow White one. Eh, not really into that one, so I'm not going to get it, even though Snow White is one of the princesses I, I collect, but I did want Mulan and Li Shang, and, um, so I got him. So I'm very excited about that. Oh, and let me show you off the backer card. If you haven't seen these, they're just gorgeous, so you can see me through that. They are incredible, the amount of stained glass on there. These are limited edition 400, I believe. 300, 300 for these, limited edition. So there are still some available, but they're also showing up in some of these mystery bags. And then the other one I got was one I wanted. Um, I got one of these and traded, but not necessarily for the one I want. I traded my friend, Melissa, over at Pixie Dust and Peaches and Pixie Pins and Peaches, Pixie Dust and Pins. <laughs> I'll post her here because I always mess that up. I, I apologize, Melissa. Um, but we traded for, I had Elsa and she really wanted that one and she had Mickey. And so I said, well, I'll take Mickey and maybe trade for the one I want, which was Minnie. I hadn't done that yet. And because I was already ordering, I went ahead and purchased Minnie. She's gorgeous, and I am working on a pink theme board, which I've mentioned to you guys. I've started putting it together. I don't like the board I have it on right now, but she's gonna look super cute as possibly a centerpiece for that board. So it includes Minnie and Piglet and um, Marie and maybe a little Lotso. All right, so this is the mystery bag. Let's go ahead and see. I see a couple of... Um, blind box pins. I'm going to pull those out first, but we'll open them after. So these are the newer series of blind box, which is interesting. I just saw, I have to go back and look because somebody had the um, Woody available and I almost traded for that. That's super cute. 
and then um, I got a second box of that. So I believe these only have one pin each. So part of the the deal of the mystery boxes was you would get a mystery pin a box, which either would contain two or you'd get two boxes. That's what the deal was. Okay, so we got those. Let's see what's next. Let's pull out the ones that aren't packaged, labeled with anything. So I've got one here. This feels like Ooh, this feels like a stained glass one. It's a square one or rectangle. Oh, it's Dumbo. No, it's, um, <laughs> it's not Dumbo. I saw the blue and it looked like Dumbo. It is, that's the genie and it is Aladdin. That's so funny. I think I purchased this pin at one point and used it for a giveaway for one of the um, subscriber giveaways. And stay tuned. If you are not subscribed, go do it now. Stop, pause, go subscribe because we are almost at 600 and we'll be doing another giveaway. And I will likely use something that's in this bag as part of that giveaway. I also have another pin I plan on giving away. I said I would open it up to international this time, so I wanna keep it to pins so the package is a little smaller, but there's gonna be some fantastic pins. So maybe, maybe this one will end up in there, but that's super cute. This is their whole storybook collection. Let's take it out of the, the wrapper real quick so you get a better look. I won't pull it off the backer card. Most of these are, um, you've seen them so many times with people opening these mystery bags probably, and most of them are either a, um, 300 limited edition or 400 limited edition. So you've got Jasmine, Aladdin, Genie, and Abu on there. And you've got the lamp and carpet as well. These are stunning. There's some really cute ones of that series. All right, next pin. All right, so I've got another one here. This one has more of a shape to it. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's the Hercules series. I haven't seen much of these. I think I've seen them come out in a couple of people have posted like either on Instagram or Facebook what they've gotten in their pack. So that is pain and panic. <laughs> They're kind of scrambling there. This has that cool backing, almost like I showed in my pin video the other day in the Encanto video, um, the grandma pin where it has, it's kind of shimmery back here and has things kind of ingrained in the or etched into the background which is pretty cool. I am not a Hercules collector so this one will well maybe that one will be a giveaway or um, as part of a uh, trade but that's a fun one. These are beautiful bright and big also these you know three inch pins. All right so so far two jumbos and the two mystery pins. Let's see what's next. Ooh, this is a good one. I'm seeing it on, um, I just said I'm not a collector of this, but I'm seeing it. I'm gonna unpackage this first. This whole series was really good. They did a villain series. I've got a villain here. I don't know that I got any villains in the mystery bag. I got the ones that were in the case that were a little bit different. Oh, I have one here like this style, but I didn't get any of the um, the three inch huge ones. It is Hades, look at that, that is cool. Well, wouldn't that make a nice giveaway? Hades and Pain and Panic. If you wanna see that in the giveaway, let me know. <laughs> Maybe you guys should vote. Um, if not, the, like I said, these will become traders because that's not something I collect, although, I don't know, it would be kind of cool to have all of these villains. Obviously I've missed a few that are probably sold out at this point. I think I have, I know I have Dr. Facilier of this one and I think I have um, Hook and maybe Cruella on a wish list somewhere. All right, we've got a couple things left in here. I see at least two more things. One feels like it's got more than one pin in it. Let's go with this one. Let's see what this is. <gasps> oh, my friend Karen is gonna be so jealous. Okay, this one says, oh, I don't wanna show you. Limited edition, unreleased pin. It's a good one, it's a good one. All right, let me give you a hint. Can you see that? Can you see it? 
Can you guess what's in here? I think it's one of the ones I mentioned that is part of some of the unreleased series. This is a good one. It's going to be probably a keeper. Okay, I'm going to have to show you because I can't get it open fast enough. You ready? It's Monsters, Inc. It is Boo! Oh, look at that glimmer. Oh, these are stunning. So these are part of the latest series. The ones that came out for Peter Pan and Alice in Wonderland look very similar to these as far as the size, the shape, the um, the border. Look how the eyeballs. So it is um, Boo dressed up in her monster costume. What's at the bottom there? That is cute. I can't really tell what it is though. So in hers, oh, it's doors. Okay, so there's little doors around the edge and this one is her door. So with the pink on there. And I think she had little hearts and stuff on her bedroom door, stickers and so forth. Super cute. Oh, I love that one. You know, if I haven't said it, these are all exclusive to Pink Alamode. Okay, we've got one more and I thought maybe this was the um, unreleased pin but this looks like another Disney 100. Let's see what's in here. Watch it be the Minnie Mouse that I just purchased. No, I don't think they do. Oh, I think this is a round one. This is probably one of those silver ones that I'm not crazy about. Are you guys, have you seen them? <gasps> but it's Elsa. Oh, well, if you gotta get one, she's a pretty one. Um, I had gotten one of the small pins in a trade that was Tiana that was this style of silver and I just don't think they show the character that well but I hadn't seen these in person that is actually pretty there is Elsa I love the colors of this hmm maybe that friend will be interested in this one too okay guys so what do we have well we still got to open those two mystery pins but here are our jumbo pins so we've got two hercules we've got an elsa this is a good bag this is a good bag i like it and we've got the dumbo and we've got boo that's the unreleased all right let's see what's in these guys at this point we're just hoping it's not a dupe and also i'm gonna go check out who was it shay was it you <laughs> that we were talking about. Okay, so you can kind of feel what some of these are. You get the shape. So this is actually feels like an end piece. Like it's either Woody or Snow White. Let's see what we got here. It feels a little smaller than I was expecting. Oh, it's Snow White. Okay, look at her holographic glitter behind her. Okay, these in person, that's really pretty. I was not gonna try to collect these and get them all, but look at that. I've not seen that type of, um, I guess it's just holographic where it's like the clear glitter, but you see all the colors in it. She's pretty. Mm, that might be one we have to go for. Pink Alamode. Some, YouTubers and I were just talking about this yesterday. No, today. Today we were just talking about it. How Palm is going to get us in trouble because they got some really cool stuff coming out. And as if we haven't gotten enough trouble with all the stuff we've been ordering from the past wonderful releases. Just these three inch pins are amazing. Okay, this feels like the same piece. And it is. Oh boy. Okay, maybe we won't be collecting this series. But if you have one and you need a Snow White, let me know. She's definitely up for trade. And now, you know, if I can do it through traders, I certainly wouldn't mind completing this set, especially seeing how sparkly it is. I don't know where I'd put it because the characters being all different, you've got Mickey and Simba, you've got Elsa, Tiana, Woody, and Snow White. I don't dislike any of those characters. Those are all great characters, so. It would be fun to have, and they don't even show you on here how it all goes together, but the these four pieces fit together 
And then I assume Mickey goes at the top of the pile there and Simba at the bottom to make one large shape. And you can probably see that on the website. And I will include the website down below. I'll include a link to Pink Ala Mode. Um, okay, you guys, go ahead and let me know what was your favorite pin today of these. I think Boo, it's it for me. Boo. We've got Aladdin. We've got Hades. We've got Elsa. And we've got Pain and Panic. And then we've also got our Snow White. And also the other ones that we purchased separately, the Minnie Mouse and the Li Shang stained glass pin. Are you guys interested in seeing a giveaway for the Hades pins? Or at least having Pain and Panic as one of them? Because I might have to keep that Hades villain. <laughs> this is pretty cool. And maybe acquire some of the other ones. I'm going to have to go check what I have. I'm pretty sure it's only, um, uh, who did I say? Dr. Facilier. So that's it for today. Um, once again, home run with Pink Ala Mode. I was a little nervous about what I would get, but it is a really good, um, really good bag. Other than the dupe of Snow White, but she's not bad to have either. So I love her. Anyway, thank you guys for joining me. Thanks for watching. Go ahead and subscribe so that you don't miss the giveaway that's coming up. And thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for your support. And I will see you on the next one. Bye.